That's a... Okay, so to put the lock set back on the door, we'll want to uh, take our spindle, which is this flat piece, and this is a right-hand reverse door, meaning the hinges are on the right, so that means that you'll be um, putting the spindle in, and from the front of the door, you'll want to rotate clockwise until it starts to bind and pull back the latch. So if it's like this, then you're good. So now I'm going to put the front assembly on the, the door, and by keeping it in this position, this allows it to uh, still rotate even when the rigid uh, thumb turn is on the outside. Otherwise, if you insert it the wrong way, it will uh, bind up and it'll be, you may not be able to egress from the inside. Um, so now we take our inside piece and we put it onto the back of this pendle. And sideways here. Yep. And no. now this will retract the latch so the spindle is engaged. Now, whoops, and I forgot to put my gasket on, which is um, this black piece. So I want to assemble it so this rests inside of this gasket. And then it goes through the slot in here. That's how we put it on the door. Okay, so that's good. Now we assemble our through bolts, so I am going to assemble, I have to get it spot on, that's where the tricky part comes in. So, okay, that's on there, top screw is on, I'm going to take the bottom bolt. You want a screwdriver with a reasonably long neck. And you don't want to tighten it too much, otherwise, like I said, this spindle will bind up. Alright, I'm going to enter a uh, combination to test it. Um, and uh, it should be properly assembled on the door, so I will have you uh, stop the film so we can uh, punch in the combination.